So what do you think? Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh. My room's down here, and you can have this one. It's bigger and has a sunroom. And Linny, you can sleep out there. I can see the ocean. We get to swim in it every day. Oh, I don't believe this. Thank you, sweetheart. I'll get a job. I'll no, what are you the thanking rent. me for, Mum? Look, you, I'd be living here anyway. I hear we're going to be related. <laughs> oh, yes, I think so. <laughs> well, would you like a drink? Uh, we're having double vodkas. Oh, why not? <laughs> Thank you, Miss Galland. Judy. Judy, <laughs> I just want to say, you've always been my idea of somebody. Then we're going to get along just fine. <laughs> oh, waiter! I just met Judy Garland. Oh, well, I imagine you'd be seeing a fair bit of her, so... <laughs> oh. oh, Pete, a wedding. Are you sure this is what you want? Are you happy? Yes, Mum. I am. I'm so glad. I have to tell you, sweetheart, mm. I've been looking at all the people here, and I know I'm just a nobody from Australia, but I wouldn't trust that man over there. Mum, that's your Brenner. Oh. Mm. Thought he looked familiar. <laughs> 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 by the power vested in me by the great state of New York, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. from marrying one. Where is that <laughs> wife of yours? Oh, well, didn't I say it? Liza's staying at the Hilton. Oh. Uh, she's about to start pre-production on the sterile cuckoo and needs time alone to climb into character. Oh. Well, must be hard playing someone else. Mm. Oh, my God, look at that sponge. Is that passion fruit? Mm. Come on, Lenny, quick. We've been all over the country, and audiences have been really receptive, haven't they, Pete? It's been incredible. We've a really polished act now, and I, I think Australian audiences will be impressed. And a reminder, you can catch the Allen Brothers tomorrow night at Checkers Nightclub. <laughs> I believe a certain someone is also appearing on the bill. Mm. Well, who's he talking about, I wonder? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, it's you. I know you. Oh, hello, husband. Did you remember to put the trash out? It's rubbish, love, in this country, it's rubbish. <laughs> Hello, Sydney. She hasn't even sung a note yet. This is a song from my upcoming album. Congratulations, Peter. She's such a terrific young woman. Thank you, Brian. I couldn't be happier. Good luck for the tour. I'm sure it'll be a huge success. Something, Bobby. Yes. I am your sweet patootie, and he is my loving man. Who's no other to his duty? Young, sir. 
surfer types everywhere. It's blonde hair, blue eyed visions. <laughs> yeah, and the RSL is just around the corner, 12 cent beers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you and David would love it. Neil, I can hear the beeps, so I better go. Okay. Yeah, we'll see you back soon. So how to David for me, okay? Yep. Lynn, there's a whole newspaper article honoring Grandad. Yeah, they're opening a library, isn't it? I didn't know that. What do you want for lunch? Pete? The late George Walner worked on High Street and lived on manners. Tennerfield Sadler. Ask the sadly. <laughs> Lived without sin, the building a library for him. Time is a traveler, ten a feel and saddle turn your head. Ride again, Jackaroo. Think I Newton John. <laughs> oh, and I've got some mail from you too. I hope you haven't sent me any more money, sweetheart. You know, I've got a job now and... What is this? It's title deeds to your apartment, Mum. What? I, I don't understand. You never have to rent again. You can paint the walls any colour you want. Oh, Peter. Well, I don't know how to thank you. Don't thank me. Thank Olivia. pockets in under orders so you got somewhere to stick your hands <clears throat> you got it strut don't flap nada boy mm. thank you Charles it's a great look hey hey oh. is mum here yet mm. Lars is here too we got half of New York out there five minutes Mr. Allen thank you Bruce good luck kid Can I get you in there? Oh, God, a triple vodka would be great. Just be you. With my hands in my pockets. I love you. I love you, too. Radio City, hmm? I like it. It's ballsy. If you crash, you may as well crash big.
I'd just like to thank the air traffic control guy who kept my plane in a holding pattern. And I found myself like Arthur, caught between the moon and New York City. I want to see my son. Peter needs some rest. For goodness sake, I'm his mother. Peter? Sweetheart, what's going on? No, 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 it's, it's, fi it's fine. No, it's not a big deal, okay? I've got throat cancer. But, God, apart from that, no, it's tradable. We came out. I want to do one more Sydney show. Pete, you can't. You're crazy. Mum, can you talk some sense into him, please? Well, I've never been able to in the past. He's such a naughty boy. <laughs> I don't believe I know that one. <laughs> we'll just stick to a nice, quiet little ballad for now. And I've been in cities that... <clears throat> and I've been a city... <clears throat> I'm so sorry, things got a, a frog in my throat. I've... Yeah. 